hi guys and welcome back to my channel today i wanted to share with you all a refresh of what i've done on my bookshelves okay this is a before picture of my bookshelf before it kind of had that teal green or that teal um, color on there and this is the after photo what I did was I wanted to really refresh the paint color and make it a little bit more neutral and make it match my formal living room a little bit better so what I did was I first I went in and decluttered everything I cleared everything off the shelves just to kind of give myself a blank canvas to start with So you guys, so what I wanted to do was, the first thing I did was I shot my home. I went in and I found things around my home that I absolutely love and I enjoy and that there's things that meant a lot to me that I wanted to kind of, that I wanted to kind of showcase on these shelves. They're also going to be um, used to store books, books that I'm interested in reading and books that I use around my home, but I also wanted to add little decorative pieces that I'm absolutely enjoying and some of the decorative pieces that I'm absolutely enjoying at this moment is my um, silver. I have been collecting um, silver pieces from various um, estate sales and uh, different thrift stores and everything. And I absolutely love the time the timeless look that it gives my um, living space. So that was something I just wanted to do. I wanted to make sure I tried to incorporate some of those pieces into the space and um, make the living room a pop a little bit better. So what I did was I took some of my favorite silver pieces that I enjoy and I just went ahead and kind of added those to my bookshelves. Now with these shelves I try to go in and try to group them but I now with the shelving units what I do to start with is I try to go in and add the larger pieces in first so like here I'm adding this beautiful water pitcher and I'm just adding some uh, faux flowers in there I have this beautiful teapot that I have found that I wanted to add there along with these beautiful candelabras and um, silver that I also have as well and I just want to make sure I go ahead and add those first and put those in the space and then I can kind of fill in the rest of the things um, after okay guys so after adding the larger pieces into the bookcases first um, I just went in and I kind of filled in all of my um, picture frames and baskets that I wanted to um, I wanted to apply to the space. I found these beautiful little baskets that I had a line around my house and I thought they would be a good neutral kind of contrast to kind of add to the bookcases. Then I kind of filled in, I like to fill in family mementos and family photos to add to add my little, um, to add to the shelving to give it a little bit more of um, our family's personality and our family style. So I wanted to go in and add um, some just some special touches with family photos and things like that. Then in each, what I use to kind of style, was I, what I use to kind of give me some type of um, blueprint or whatever to kind of style these shelves is I try to kind of group uh, more than one thing in the shelf at a time, maybe like in groups of threes or fours or sometimes groups of twos just to kind of give each, uh, each individual space uh, some dimension. And then after I go ahead and add all of the larger pieces and all the little knickknacks in there, then I go ahead and try to add um, my uh, books into the space. Now for the books that I'm adding into the space is a, uh, is a variation between um, designer uh, coffee table books and interior design books and it's mixed in also with some um, low end kind of books, uh, books that I got from the Dollar Tree and um, just everyday fiction books and things that I like to read. What I did was I tried to make sure that all of the backings of the book kind of, the books kind of coordinate with the theme of my living room or maybe this um, maybe uh, that are neutral so that it'll blend in better with my decor and at the book some of my favorite books as you can see here at the top that I'm adding um, those books I didn't worry about the uh, backing or anything like that because I just absolutely love reading them so what I did was I turned them around I turned them around so that the color is kind of facing the opposite way and all you see is kind of like just the, uh, the color of the pages which is very neutral so that way it kind of blends blend in better with the uh, shelving unit itself. 
And then after I go ahead and uh, fill in all of the spaces with my um, books and everything, I just anything that's left over and that I would like to add, I kind of just go ahead and just play around with it and try to uh, place different little uh, objects or knickknacks into the space to kind of see what kind of look and flow that I'm going, that I'm um, trying to achieve. And there's no rhyme or reason or no right or wrong way for styling these shelves. You put your personality, your touch, whatever you enjoy um, viewing or watching or things like that, that's what you would add to this space. Just something that will kind of give it your own touch and your own personality. So there is no right or wrong way, but just however, just do what you love to do and what you like to see into your home because you're going to be the one that's looking at it. So you can use these shelves as a different uh form of kind of display or whatever for whatever items that you would like to display not only books but but objects as well yes guys so this is how the bookshelves are looking so far and i'm absolutely loving the way it is turning out and what i usually do is i just kind of step back and see how everything is looking so far and then if i need to move things around i kind of just move things around and play around with the placement of things and everything until i uh, receive a cohesive look and like I said, these bookshelf is an actual IKEA hack that I um, that my husband actually installed for me. This is a little niche that we have inside of our um, formal living room, and I wanted to actually put something here that was going to kind of elevate the space. I wanted something to be like timeless and elegant and just classy, and just kind of add a nice little special touch to our formal living room. So we actually installed these um, IKEA bookcases, and actually these are the IKEA built bookcases if I can find the link um, I'll try to link it in the description box but they are three individual bookcases uh, they are three individual separate bookcases that we kind of put together to kind of build a uh, formal built-in if, if that's what um, yeah a formal built-in and I absolutely uh, love the way it's turning out so I hope you guys enjoyed this little video and I hope you love this. Um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, Decorate With Me video and I hope that this brings you some home inspiration and gives you some decorating ideas for decorating your own home. If you do enjoy this video, please consider uh, giving me a big thumbs up and subscribing to the channel so that you will be a part of the family and so that you will be notified every time um, I upload a new video and you don't miss a new video. And to all of my returning subscribers and everybody that's watching i thank you all for watching and i'll see you all in my next video bye